Jaguar in stadium practice in the books. We got Jaguar defensive tackle Devon Hamilton here with us. Devon, took some good work going out there today, man. How were things? Yeah, they were great. Uh, we got some good work. Uh, we competed today, and I felt like we got better. Certainly the crowd was uh, really behind you guys. A big turnout for a Saturday morning at 10 a.m. What is that like to see all these fans out here? Well, that's very encouraging. You know, uh, we did very well last year, and I'm just happy that everybody's coming back and hopefully filling this stadium when it comes fall. Quite the offseason for you. The team showed their support for you and that brand-new contract. What did that mean to you, the, the team that drafted you, extended you, so most of your career now will be in Jacksonville? Um, I was very excited. Um, I really wanted to stay here in Jacksonville. Um, I love it here. I love the stadium. I love fans. I love the new facility we have. I just love what we're building, and um, I really love my guys around here. You're a young guy, but you've seen some things here in Jacksonville from where things were to where things are now. Yeah. I mean, how do, you, how do you compare and contrast where this team is now? now to say maybe your rookie year uh, we definitely have built it from where we were to where we are now I mean it's a complete 180 um, in a very positive way I felt like we really changed things around here you know you'll get the offense we'll get to your side of the ball in a moment but when you're practicing against Trevor and ETN and your DBs have to deal with Ridley Kirk and Jones I mean iron sharpens iron going against that offense must make you guys better oh yeah every day I mean I love going against Sheriff every day he gets me better every day I feel like there's no better guard out there than him, so I'm excited for it. You mentioned Sheriff. What do you see out of Fortner? Second year in the league, started every game last year. You like where his game is up? He's definitely growing and growing every day. I mean, you see he's getting more more reps, more experience on what he's doing, and um, he's definitely getting better every day. To your side of the ball, there's you, there's RRH, you know, Josh Allen, Trayvon Walker. Are you excited what this front seven could become this year? Yeah, we just go out there and dominate. That's all it really is, but um, I, I'm very excited for those two. I mean, they're going to have some good opportunities to rush this year and uh, hopefully it turns out in production. You're a veteran. You've seen your share of players around the league. Year two for Muma, Devin Lloyd, Trayvon Walker. Mm. Does game slow down for them at all? How would you assess that year one to year two? Oh, definitely slowing down a bit. I mean, they're understanding what's going on, understanding formations a little bit better and seeing things a little bit quicker. So it's going to help them improve their game a lot. You know, as we begin to wrap up with Devon Hamilton, a lot of expectations on the team this year. Do you guys hear the outside chatter? Do you know what's being said outside this building as far as you guys in 2023? It don't even matter. <laughs> very simple, huh? <laughs> yeah, very simple. Uh, it don't even matter. I mean, we just got to focus on what we got to do and put what we can put on the field. Final question. What about you? From where you were for second year to where you are now, brand new contract, how have you improved as a player? I feel like I'm just getting better as far as this experience overall. I mean, experience is all you can really ask for as far as seeing things and understanding what they're trying to do to you as an offense and just understanding where the ball's going to be at. Devon, best of luck. Thank you so much.